Lake Mead levels are on the upswing thanks to a record snowpack in the Rockies. The lake is at 1,066 feet, nearly at the same level it was in 2021. You can see how the snowpack and efforts to conserve more water have caused the lake to rise right here at a time when it has happened and when it has dropped in the last few years. In the meantime, states and agencies are weighing in on the plan to keep water in Lake Mead going forward. The current law of the river expires in 2026. Still, some of the states, tribes, and environmental groups along the river are at odds. One of the most contentious points, how to account for evaporation. 10% of the river's water is lost to it, but that wasn't factored into the current agreement. Arizona wants to spread out the burden of any cuts going forward across all the states along the river. They take most of the mandatory cuts right now. The upper basin states like Colorado and Wyoming just want Arizona, California, and Nevada to take those cuts. And California wants to keep things the way it is, with Arizona getting the short end of the stick. Many of the Native American tribes along the river want the states and not them to absorb evaporation cuts. Meanwhile, environmentalists are pushing to fill Lake Mead before Lake Powell, where less water would be lost to evaporation. The main sticking point with that would be the massive amounts of tourism dollars created by Lake Powell.